Hello and welcome back to Pokemon Rumble Blast. I am the legendary Pokemaster, and today we are in Axeltown. I hope this is the finale, because that means I beat Pro Victini. Because he had, I think, 34 or 36 episodes. I think 34. And that means I have 32. So, haha. -ha. Actually, not haha, -ha, because he quit YouTube, which is sad because I liked his videos. But, that does not matter. Well, it kind of does, but... We are going to try and beat this area today, so, le let's, not leets, um, let's pick, I'm gonna pick Maynectric, Maynectric, I can't even speak, I have like a canker sore, and then Milotic, so we will start team battle, yes, okay, I don't need to see that cutscene, I've seen it 10 trillion, not really, times, and I'm being the most strongest we have, Bisharp. Or the str just the strongest we have, Bisharp. So, I could take command, basically, of the team. So, there's a Spinda. I I'm gonna try to take... I found uh, the strategy with this place from last time is that you need to take out the Spindas. Because they, like, confuse you. And it's really annoying. So, let's just take out the Dragonite here. Oh, okay, good. And we can move on to the next area. I'm just going to focus a bit better. As usual. This might be the last time I'm saying that. I don't know. But if, if, the, if the focus stays locked, then that's the last time I'm saying that. Okay, we're not very healed, but it should do. Because if we don't get damaged too much, we might be able to take out Groudon. And get a substantial amount of HP back. So, let's take out the Rhyperiors and uh, Rhyhorns, I think it is. I think those are Rhyhorns. They might be Rhydons. Okay, everyone join together. Let's just take out as much HP as we can from Groudon while we're hyper mode. We took about half already. Okay, good. If everyone would just gang up on Groudon instead of going everywhere, maybe it would work out better, but... Yeah. Let's see, Maynetric has the idea. Nobody else does. But yeah, my theory was correct. My hypothesis. We got all of our HP back. I'm just going to check for any wind-up energies. Because we need those now. We used our wind-up or hyper mode on that Groudon. I'm just like adjusting the stand here. So, let's grab them all. Gotta grab them all. Gotta grab them all. That's my catchphrase in this. Alright, I'll cover you, Melodic. I finally just... That's the first time I actually ever protected a teammate. In this entire Let's Play. So let's just try to take out Palkia right away. With no mercy. At all. Um. Because we really need him out as fast as possible. So. Yes. We got him out. Let's take that wind-up energy. If we have any. Um. This is not the boss. So. Let's move on. I believe this is, uh. I forgot what it was from, from last time. Or, did we even do this last time? I don't even think we got this far last time, so... Yeah. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna save the wind-up energy for the area boss. Or the hyper mode, I guess you could say. For the area boss. Come on. Get gotten. Get gotten. Okay. It's Zekrom. So, everyone, we know what to do. Hyper mode! Oh. He's going away, so it's going to be hard to hit him with Hyper Mode. But we might be able to get at least an okay chunk of his HP done with. Oh, he's going to do that. Okay, that's never good, generally. Once again, just general statement. Let's just get him. Good. Cover him. Come on. Dang it. Okay, is that it? Yeah, that's it. Okay, so we're just going to, um, that's a shame. Um, yeah. My A button isn't working for some reason. Well, it was, but it was just taking forever to load back. So, we have this exclamation point here. Let's peek into the toy shop. We're probably not going to use whatever Pokemon appears, but a customer came to the toy shop. AJ came and bought toys. Spent 25,000 pennies. Customers have come to this shop a total of 16 times. Something cool might happen after 20 visits. I might do, like, an after story, like, a post story, 
series on this. Maybe on, like, the second channel or something, but... Maybe as a Let's Play once, because if I finish White 2 before Sun and Moon comes out, I'll probably, like, start doing the, uh, post story. So, yeah. To fill in the time. Or I might just do some, uh, Pokemon Online games, and I'm serious, it's not a joke. I use that in a joke, you know, as a joke, not in a joke. Well, technically in a joke. In one of my previous videos, on um, one of my Tuesday videos, I, I said that they were bad. They're not too bad. They're okay, the Pokemon Online games on the website. I actually have a Pokemon Trainer Club account, so I get points from doing that, but... Oh, okay. Come on. Dang it. I hate those gears. That's like the hardest thing that those things on the side shoot out throughout this entire... Um, this entire fort, I guess. So anyway, yeah, I might just do some, um, online games if I finish some post story. But I heard the post story is pretty long, so I'll probably... I'll, I'll, I'm not even sure if I'll need filler. I might actually not finish Y2 in time for the release of, uh, Sun and Moon. I'm gonna get Sun personally, because, I don't know. I've always liked the, uh version that comes first and when it's you say sun and moon for some reason i've always had a knack for getting those except for uh yeah like i have black too i have um i have soul silver which doesn't work soul silver and heart gold you don't say that you say heart gold and soul silver and then there's um what else do i have omega ruby and uh black version i'm frozen dang it I hate being frozen. You know, hypothermia is not healthy. That's a fun fact for you people, you peel place out there who want to play Pokemon. Hypothermia, it's not a good thing for your health. Okay, so let's just take out Palkia here. He's paralyzed. This is our chance, peel place. Come on. Oh, we got him. Okay, so that's the HP. We can get some wind-ups. Hopefully we'll get enough wind-ups from these, um... These weird small Pokemon. I don't even know what to call them. So that we could actually use the hyper mode on the, uh... On the boss. The area boss. Which is Zekrom. Now I know that. So let's just... Gotta grab them all here. And, uh... Grab them all. And then we'll just use the, uh... The hyper on Zekrom. So... Yeah. I think this is gonna be like the last one. Maybe. Yeah. Okay. So let's just hyper up on him. Come on. Come on. You could do it. Or at least you could take away an okay chunk, I, I hope. For some reason, the entire hyper mode got, um, like, frozen. Like, confused, dizzy. I don't know what you want to refer to it as. But they got it, so. Oh. This is our kind of chance, I guess. Almost. Come on. Ooh. We're, we're almost... Ooh, dang it, dang it. We have a low amount of HP. That was... That was so close. That was so close. I'm just gonna catch back up to where Zekrom was. Okay, guys. So, I just beat Zekrom, and it started playing prophetic music. Yes. And I beat it by switching Melodic with Drudigan, and we're all fully healed up except for me. Ooh. This looks dangerous. And it's not healthy to do dangerous things, as I was stating before. So, naturally, let's go across it. Silence. <laughs> okay, so let's just take out all these sigilists here. Ooh, dang it. There's one of those, like, a totem pole or something. I don't know. It looks like, um, those Zelda enemies. Oh. It's time to stop playing around. Dark Rust. Okay, so I'm guessing we need to take it out. Now you shall know my true power. That was not a good one. Okay, let's take it out, everyone. Oh, we almost got it. 
Oh, barrier. Come on. Well, that was just se like seven seconds of pure silence. So let's just, we need to take it out, I guess, before it does another barrier. Dang it. It just, like, heals itself while it's in the barrier, so... That's just a shame. We need to take out the barrier somehow. So... Let's, oh! Cutscene. As long as I have this barrier... I shall be invincible. Then I'll just have to destroy it. Whoa! The key holds all of my power. With this key, I'll break down the barrier. Take that, Dark Rust. It's key against key. Well, well yeah, I, I get it. That's kind of funny. This cannot be. Your key will break too. If it breaks, that's the end of you. That's right. This is my answer. This is my justice. Now it's up to you, champion. Yes, I am the champion. Ooh, that's not good. This is real serious Daphne Johansson Hyrule stuff going on. That just repeated a few times. Goodbye. Not you. How dare you? You think you'd have a chance just because my barrier is gone? Well, yeah. Everything will vanish in the darkness. Okay. I'm, I'm... I don't want that to happen, but... Yeah, we could probably just take you out. So let's just use the old-fashioned strategy of... A beat-em-up game by beating him up mercilessly. Come on. Everyone needs to take him out. He just, like, regenerates health randomly. I think. No, we got, we almost got him. Oh, we got him. Impossible. I lost. Quag. That doesn't look healthy. Kids. Remember what you learned in this Let's Play. Stuff that damages you is not healthy. Yeah, that looks like Hyrule. Like a Hylian something. Seems like something they built. Toyland is now safe. The spirit of justice and the 
tower of friendship prevailed. So, that is it for Pokemon Rumble Blast. Wow, it has been so long. I can't believe I actually did it. I thought that I wouldn't beat this and would move on to another Let's Play in the beginning. Like, in the first few episodes, like, one, two, three, four. And then I actually got used to playing it, because I thought I kind of sucked at first, but now, you know, I'm a bit of a... I'm, I'm not an expert. Um... But yeah, this game was pretty fun, actually. And it's been seven months. My Let's Play schedule only only allows, as you probably know, for one Let's Play per week. I might change that in the future, probably not. But yeah, that's why it took so long. But we have 32 episodes now. 32 will be the final. And I might start a new episode, or, well, no, episode series, I guess you could say. I was just gonna say series. On the afterward, like the post-game stuff, because there is a lot of that, apparently. I guess these are all my Pokemon that I caught that I never looked back on, but yeah, that Victini, if you could train it, was would have been really useful, probably. But no, I just used Bisharp because it has a power of, like, 1900, which is pretty good. It was 1954. So, yeah. That's a Pidgey back there. That's a Woobat, Chimchar, Magmar, uh, Boldor, Reuniclus, Curlia, Zigzagoon, um, Ekans, I'm just, <laughs> they're going by so fast I can't even shout them out, like, Kofagrigus, Yamask, two Zubats, a Grimer, a Charmeleon, Drillbur, Budyu, Seismitoad, Cherim, Paras, um, what else? I, I'm just lost track at this point. That's Bellsprout, that's, uh, Caterpie, that's Ninetales, back there is Machop, here's an Onix, behind it is a Glagar, and then, Glagar, <laughs> and then there's a Skuntank. I never really used that, or the Yanma, or there's a Trap Inch right there. I wish I got, like, a Flygon. Flygon would have been cool. Okay. So, yeah, enough with my blabbing. That is the end.